My district in the Central Valley is one of the many uh, across central, uh, Western U.S. that has struggled with severe drought in recent years. While the last few months have brought much needed rainfall to our state, we do not have enough water storage to capture and store this critical resource. Drought will be back before we know it, and the people in my community will once again be asking why we couldn't hold on to more of the rain we've seen in the recent months. And the reason I bring this up is Sites Reservoir is a, a reservoir in Northern California that we've been talking about in California for 60 years, so longer than my life, obviously, and a lot of people in this room, and we can't get those permits approved. Lake Success, a reservoir not far from me that is overflowing as we speak because of all this rainfall, it took 30 years. I was probably still in high school when they started talking about this, just for them to be able to expand an existing reservoir 10 feet to be able to hold some of this water. And so when we look at the situation where I've now got neighbors sending me pictures as they're evacuating their houses, they're evacuating their farms. One neighbor only a mile from my house, a couple miles from my house is actually moving his cows off of his farm as we speak. And so we're losing all this water out into the ocean. We're losing it into uh, people's farms, people's homes. Um, we're not able to capture this water because of the permitting. Um, this administration is something, and I know this isn't directly under OMB, but it is something that needs to be addressed, and I would hope that the president understand the value of that water that we're wasting today because that would help us create jobs for, for years to, to come because we would be able to farm ground instead of the situation where we had over the last year or two where we weren't able to farm a lot of our ground because of the lack of water. So what policies in the president's budget support water storage, and what is the administration do, doing to ensure regulatory red tape is removed so that these critical store, uh, storage projects can be constructed as soon as possible? So I spoke about this earlier, and I know we're short on time, but one, I think <coughs> there is room here in a bipartisan way to work on permitting. Uh, both sides have plans. Both sides have said they want to do something about it. We have to sit down and do something about it. OMB has a small piece of guidance we put out to try to help streamline, but it's going to take congressional uh, action to do something uh, further, and you've heard the president talk about this, so I, I hope uh, the room opens uh, to be able to have uh, fulsome conversations uh, that result in, in changes there. Uh, we, we do, with bill resources, bipartisan infrastructure law, um, put some funding in the West towards drought. Um, and we are not taking it for granted that the rain will not continue forever, and we've got to find long-term solutions. Uh, Water Smart is one of the things we're doing, but we know it's too little, um, and we've got to figure out something. 40 million people, I know more than half, uh, are in California who are dealing with uh, the Colorado River uh, situation alone. Um, so you have my commitment to work on long-term drought solutions. Uh, just one West. thing to note, in the bipartisan infrastructure bill, one of the reasons why I was very much in opposition to it was because it specifically was drafted in a way that would prevent one of our most affordable projects from being expanded, which is uh, Shasta Reservoir, and why they would do that in a piece of legislation. I mean, if you're looking to save money and invest, that would be one way. And in California, it's always interesting. If they want to build high-speed rail or they want to build a football stadium in L.A. or San Francisco, environmental regulations almost don't even exist to them. But we talk about a reservoir for 60 years and can't break ground the on it. The gentleman's time has oh, expired. Thank you. Very important issue for the West.